Welcome back to The Soulful Cook, where I share with you some of my favorite healthy plant-based recipes. Today, we are gonna continue on our Instant Pot series with one of my favorite potato recipes. We are gonna be making Instant Pot Alu Gobi, which is potatoes and cauliflower. If you would like the detailed version of this recipe, head over to my blog at thesoulfulcook.com. All right, let's cook something healthy. Here's everything you're gonna need to get started. All right, so for this recipe, we actually need one large onion diced. You can easily do the manual way with a knife. I'm just gonna speed up the process and throw my onion into a food processor and let it do the job for me. And now in our Instant Pot with the saute mode on, I'm gonna add in my mustard seeds. and my cumin seeds. And I'm gonna just let those lightly toast until they start to crackle. Once they've started crackling, you're gonna add in your diced onion. And then just give that a good mix and make sure the onions are nicely covered with the seeds. And then we'll add in our ginger garlic paste. You can use store-bought or you can just take some fresh ginger and fresh garlic, throw it in a mortar and pestle, and then just mash it up and then just throw it into the Instant Pot. As usual, we don't use any oil, so I'm just gonna use a little bit of water to help saute and cook the onions. <laughs> And now I'm going to add in my serrano pepper. And you don't need too much water, just enough to make sure nothing sticks to the bottom. Alright, so now with our spices, I'm going to add a tablespoon of cumin powder. one and a half tablespoons of coriander powder, one teaspoon of jat masala, one teaspoon of red chili powder, one teaspoon of turmeric, and half a tablespoon of garam masala. And now I'm just gonna give that a good mix to make sure all the spices get cooked properly. And again, using a little bit of water to make a nice little paste. Then I'm gonna add in half a cup of dried fenugreek or kasuri methi and make sure everything is nicely well combined. And then I'm gonna add in my cubed potatoes and I've used five large gold potatoes. And then one cauliflower and just make sure they're cut into nice sized florets. And then throw in your salt. And now you wanna mix that to make sure the cauliflower and the potatoes are all completely coated with the mixture. This will give your arm a good workout, but you wanna make sure everything is covered properly and evenly. Perfect. So now we're just gonna add 
a fourth to a third cup of water. You don't need too much because you don't want it to be mushy. I've added about a fourth cup. And then just give it a rough mix. You don't need to over mix it at this point. Just a rough mix to make sure everything is still covered in spice. And then we're gonna turn our instant pot on, make sure the nozzle is turned to sealing. And then we're gonna pressure cook that for six minutes, followed by natural release. And all you have left to do is just garnish it with some fresh cilantro and enjoy. All right, there you have it. Easy instant pot alu gobi or potato cauliflower. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you're looking for more healthy plant-based recipes, head over to my blog at thesoulfulcook.com. Leave a comment down below if there's something specific you would like to see on my channel next. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.